Liz. Hi, so it is the end of the month of July, and we are here to give you today what our July favorites were. I mean, every video we do, I'm always like, I can't believe it's June. It is the end of July. It's yeah. crazy. Um, <laughs> we're just going to launch right in, and because I'm a dork, and one of my favorite things this month has been my iPhone. <laughs> First of all, I love my hot pink case that I got, but this iPhone, Mindy's had one now for a while, and I used to have the Droid, which I did love the Droid, but it was old, and when I went to get one, I just got the iPhone, and can you say that I'm addicted? Oh, I'm she's addicted. addicted to the <laughs> iPhone, and I'll tell you what, I'm a huge, huge dork, and so is my husband, because Words with Friends has been our favorite game, and we are, he's been traveling, so we're like playing back and forth. Anyway, this has changed my life, watching YouTube videos, uh, working on our blog with yeah. it, tweeting, games, apps. I mean, I have an iPad, but oh my god. Yeah, I think she knows my now um, what my obsession was with it when I first yeah. got mine. I'm still obsessed with mine, but I know it's our awesome. very favorite thing to do is to lay in bed at night after you know the day is done and you know yes. your TV's off to turn on the iPhone and watch YouTube videos while you play Words with Friends. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> I just had to share that because I've been loving it so much. Okay, we'll That's move awesome. on to something else. <laughs> All right, I wanted to show a favorite shampoo and conditioner set that I got this month. This is the Frederick Fakai Glossing, Stri Glossing Starter Kit. I got this at Target, nothing fancy, um, but it came with a shampoo, a conditioner, and a styling cream. Here, I have the little bottles here. They're decent sized bottles for a little starter kit. They are four ounces. So, um, the shampoo, the conditioner, and then also... This is a cream that hydrates, sleeks, and shines. So I have been loving the Fakai Summer Marine Anti-Frizz Cream that I, you saw in my favorites last month. So since I know that I like the Fakai brand now, I figured I'd go ahead and try a shampoo and conditioner. I always like to change up my shampoo and conditioners. I always I, I buy different ones every single time that I'm, I'm done with one. I, I never buy the same shampoo twice. So um, that was one of my very favorite finds for this month. And she taught me something. I didn't realize that Target sold Fakai products. Yeah. I've never paid attention, so it's kind of exciting. Yes. Um, okay, there, you're probably going to shoot me for this one um, because we've talked about it so much, but it's the Laura <laughs> Geller Blush and Brighten and Apricot Berry. I'm not even going to show you. We just did a review on this. You know how we both feel. Um, that's why hers is not here. We were just going to show one and say we both love these. Um, can't say enough. Love yeah. it. It's my favorite. Okay. Just had to give it a little favorite. shout out. Yeah, just had to throw her in there one more time. <laughs> and no, we're not getting paid to say that. <laughs> we really are just that thrilled about this blush. So Yeah. Okay. Okay. And then I have two lip glosses that were kind of surprise finds for me for the month of July. These are the L'Oreal Lip Gloss Lip Shines. They're the color Riche. I got this one in Baby Blossom. It's like a pale pink. And then I also got this one in Golden Splash, which is more of like a coral. And they taste really good, which is so important to me <laughs> because is. I can't stand putting something on my lips for color that has like a foul taste to it. Ugh. <laughs> so, anyway, I love the taste of these. They taste like icing. Mm. And um, so, since they taste good, you know they also smell good. They and they are very good. pigmented for a high gloss shine. There's a lot of color to them. The baby pink one is obviously super soft. And the coral one is super bright and really fun. And I love it. And they're at Target. <laughs> yeah, I got one of these at Target Rite Aid. and one of them at Rite Aid. So... Yeah, awesome. Gotta love she loves them finds. so much that I'm actually going to go and maybe play with a different color. Yeah, I'm excited should. about it. I think I'll probably get a couple more colors. Like, they yeah. have another coral that's even brighter than this that I'm like, I don't know, maybe I'll try it. It seems yeah. like it would be fun. And then they also have, like, a brown nude Ooh. that looks really pretty. Cool. So more of these are probably going to be in my pocket soon. And I'm going to try it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have lip products, too. And... I'll just, ooh, I'm dropping stuff. Um, I kind of mentioned this duo. It's the MAC High Tea. You guys have seen that before. And the NARS and Easy Lover. Um, hauled this at the end of June from the Sephora event that we did. And mentioned that I liked this combo. Uh, this has been my go-to combo. I'll just show it. I mean, you guys know this. It's like a light pinky nude. This looks 
bright, bright, bright. It's not really, but it's perfect. Um, love these together, and I've been wearing this a lot solo. Mm -hmm. Funny thing is she just talked about the L'Oreal, which is a lot cheaper than this, obviously, mm -hmm. and it tastes really good. Um, that's my only complaint about this is that it tastes lipsticky, but obviously I love it. I'm going to wear it, and I've even picked out my next color because I like <laughs> how these feel. They're not sticky, but they're glossy. Um, they have staying power, go figure, even when you're, like, drinking and stuff. Um, so if NARS would just change the taste, this mm -hmm. would be, like, the Perfect. best, you know, the best... I don't know, higher end, I guess, like, you know, department store brand, whatever, Sephora yeah. brand. Yeah. Um, because the one that she just talked about is pretty awesome, too. Yeah, and those are, like, five, five or six yeah. bucks, maybe, so. We, we, we show it all Yeah, we do. We, we cover a little bit of everything. <laughs> okay, and speaking of covering every, a little bit of everything, I have a nail buffer to show y'all. Have y'all seen this Revlon Crazy Shine? It's in the shape of a teardrop, and on one side it has a buffing pad, and on the other side it has this shine pad. And I don't even know what is this thing is made of. I mean, there's just foam in the middle, but I like the buffer end for just a good hit on the tips of your nails to smooth them out. But the shine side... I didn't believe it. I didn't buy into the hype of that it gave you this crazy shine, but it does. Now, I think that these are really perfect for someone who goes, you know, without nail polish a lot because mm -hmm. you can shine your nails up with this and it looks like you have a really nice top coat, clear Ooh, coat, nice. like on your nails. Mm -hmm. And I personally like it because I like the surface that it makes of my nail to apply polish to. It just makes it super, super smooth. Um, and when even after I've taken my polish off, and it's been a couple days since I've had polish on there, when I remove my polish, my nails still have the shine from That's this, cool. which is insane. So I just really like this new nail file that I got. So I was like, <laughs> it's a definitely a great find. It's awesome. I'm excited about it. So if y'all haven't tried it, you need to go out and Check it out. Again, like Rite Aid, CVS, like just your local drugstore. That's awesome. Yeah. I love that. Um, I'm going to follow her again with <laughs> nails because she actually turned me on to the China Glaze Strong Adhesion Base Coat. Um, I love painting my nails, and you guys know that we both love polishes, but shockingly enough, I never really used a base coat. Uh, and Mindy was like, why aren't you using one? I'm like, I don't know. And so she told me, go get this one. It will make your manicure last so much longer. Between yes. this and the Sachet Vite that we use, um, it looks like I haven't used much. I've used it about six times, though. Don't need a ton. It's not mm -hmm. like a top coat. No. And um, it really has lengthened, I think, helped lengthen your manicure. Yes. Yeah. It's awesome. So, I mean, maybe it doesn't have to be the China Glaze. I love this one. Um... But base coats, man, awesome. Yeah. Love this. And we found that at Ulta. Yep. So you I think it was like eight bucks. It, and eight bucks, and I've used it like six or seven times. And it doesn't put it It looks like I've it. hardly touched it. Yeah, so. you just need a little bit. Yep. And then I also am going to stick on the nail train for um, one more go round. But I have just ran out of my China Glaze Strong Adhesion Base Coat. So I was looking for a new one. And I like to try new brands. I like to be able to um, support other brands other beauty mm -hmm. brands and to mix it up a little bit. Absolutely. So I found this duo of a Barrielle base coat and top coat. The base coat is a nail rebuilding protein and the top coat says that it's an ultra speed dry manicure extender. So I've been using this for about the past week and a half and I paint my nails pretty much every two to three days. Mm -hmm. I change the color out um, and I have noticed that since I'm using this my polish isn't chipping, it's not wearing off, um, and I'm really, really pleased with just finding a new brand because I like to just try something different every once in a right. while. I don't reach for the same brands every time when it comes to things like nail polishes or shampoos and conditioners or so. Equal opportunity here. Yes, and I actually <laughs> got these in a duo in a package from TJ Maxx. They were <laughs> sold together as a set, and I think I paid like... Seven ninety nine for the duo. Mindy can find some TJ Maxx. I'm, like, I'm all about the good deals. That's awesome. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So just hit your local TJ Maxx or Marshalls um, and definitely don't forget to check out their beauty products because a lot of times they have really great brands marked down, incredibly discounted. Just have to have patience and look. <laughs>
Um, I have a couple more things. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, this is kind of, I'm going to talk about them at the same time. I got them at the same time. You guys saw when I went to the Jamie Gets Schooled, when I went mm -hmm. to the Mac, um, little Mac class. Uh, it's the False Lashes Mascara, and then it's the Eyebrow Pencil and Lingering, and love these things. Um, I mentioned that this might be my new favorite, like, thing ever. Um, I'm not wearing it today. I forgot to put it on. Yeah, I forgot <laughs> to put it on. I'm so sorry, but I have been wearing it, and I love it. That's okay. Don't work. Um, <laughs> and the false lashes, uh, you know, we'll buy, I mean, I've worn Dior, which I did like. Yeah. Um, also, like, Lash Blast from the drugstore, from Target or whatever. Yeah. But I got this. I think it was, like, 18 something $18 and I love it I feel like it really makes my lashes look longer um I dig it These you got things. yours in black mm -hmm. I wonder mm -hmm. if I would like it in brown I don't know all I, I saw know. was Maybe black there um but I bet they have brown but hmm. I love this to check I love it a lot I can't believe I forgot to wear this that's okay anyway <laughs> you can apply it later <laughs> I'm gonna apply it right after this okay and then my last thing for the month of July was a bath wash a body wash that I found this is the brand called Shea Moisture and it's a coconut and hibiscus Shea butter wash with don't laugh at me Songyi mushroom I have no idea that's if I'm pronouncing that I like, right. That's a good attempt. Um, it says that it's for brightening and toning. This was not inexpensive. Um, I picked this up at Target. I want to say it was $18 to $20. So okay. I might have lost my mind maybe for a little moment. But um, I am sold on anything that smells good. And to me, this smells exactly like pineapples, which happens to be one of my favorite fruits. And I absolutely love oh, it. That smells awesome. Um, so I have been addicted to, it's down to like there, and I've had it for a couple of weeks. So I've been addicted to this for the month of July. And um, as far as brightening and toning, I don't know, but <laughs> I, they sound like two things that would work for me and that I would like. So I'm trying it out. We'll see what I think. Um, I have a lot of the bottle left, so, but it was definitely one of my July favorite finds. Cool. Yeah. Um. I have something that, I have two things left. I'll try to make it quick. Uh, this is a Vaseline Cocoa Butter Vitalizing Gel Body Oil. Um, I will say this. I bought this months ago. I <laughs> hated it when I brought it home. Um, you'll see that there's not a lot that I've used. Okay. Well, let me just say this. I bought it literally around the time we started the blog because I bought it near the same time that we got the Neutrogena sesame oil. Yeah, so about three months okay. ago probably. The sesame oil I still love. It's still in my bathroom. It's still a go-to. I love it. Mm -hmm. uh, when I tried this, I was like, ooh, I wasted my money. I, you put this on and you look like an oil slick. Like, what is this? I mean, I put it on and I got in the bed and I felt like the next day I needed to wash my sheets, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, hated it. So then I think I was watching YouTube videos and saw someone mention this product and just how you don't use a lot. Light bulb! I was like, hmm. Because I hate to buy stuff and then never use it again. I feel like yeah. I wasted my money, even if it takes me months to use it or a year to use it. Yeah. Um, so I started using it again this month, just a little bit. Let me just tell you, a little goes a long way. What you, you don't slather it on like regular body lotion. Mm -mm. Yeah. You're gonna slip right out of the bed when you go to get in. <laughs> I mean, literally a little bit. Like, I use like a big pea size just for an arm. Yeah. It gives a really nice sheen if you like that. I do, especially in the summertime. I love to use it right when I get out of the shower, whether I get out of the shower in the morning or mm -hmm. right before bed, I even use it. Mm -hmm. It kind of goes in, but it does leave a little bit of a like a light oil look. Um, it's not oily, it's not right? Heavy, no. It's not oily. Like, you guys no. probably can't see that. Um, but it just feels so moisturizing. What does it smell like? It smells good. Like a, like a light cocoa butter. Very light. Oh, yeah. Nothing, nothing too strong nothing and heavy. nothing that would uh, take away from like if you wear perfume or anything. Mm -hmm. um, but I love this and I really think it looks nice on your legs and stuff like if you're wearing a dress or oh, a skirt yeah. right before you go out. Yeah. Just to give them a little bit of something. But like shine. I said, a little goes a long way and it was a product that I hated and now I loved. So, okay, I'm going to really speed now. this up. <laughs> uh, I have the Twirl Rollerball you guys saw from the Sephora event that I got. Looks like I haven't used it, um, but I had a sample. I finished that up. This and Jennifer Aniston, oh, Lord, all I'm saying. <laughs> I 
seven. <laughs> Us girls and our roller balls. And to think that I used to not like perfume. Now oh, I'm all sitting here talking about perfumes all the yeah. time. And then I'm sorry for rambling, but I have one last thing. I got Jamie's had a really good month of July. It's, been fun. it's your birthday next month, Jamie. I know. I know. Um, my Mark by Mark Jacobs watch the like black rubbery stuff. I forget what that's called. It's like a, is it a silicone band? Yeah, the silicone and rose gold. Um, you saw this in a haul, and I cannot stop wearing this. Yeah. I love it. Well, because it's hot. It's my it's my baby. I love it. And I didn't have it on today. I actually made myself wear something different. Um, but this has been one of my favorites. So thank you, Beverly and Joe, for my gift card. Could you help me get this? Um, and I've just been enjoying it so much. And I've come to realize that I really like this silicone. Yeah, and like I'd like another silicone watch. This watch comes in other colors. Purple. It comes in and a rose gray. gold and gray. I want. I oh, think, and white. Oh, the gray is so. Pretty. Mindy loves the gray. It's pretty. Yeah. But yeah, I just had to I just had to mention it because I feel like I've been wearing it a lot and that excites me. Yeah, we have a love affair for anything that goes on our wrist. So if it's a, a watch or a bracelet, you're gonna see it here. It's good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool. So we hope we turned you on to some different products. Um I know I wanna go get some lip gloss lip glosses. I know. And they're so expensive. It's a great yeah. find. Awesome. So let us know yeah. what you found for the month of July because we would love to maybe check it out for August. Absolutely. Hope you right. enjoyed watching this. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye.